Hi, I'm Nav Chakravarti, Vice President of Product Management for Oracle's Knowledge Management Products. I'm here to talk to you today about our November 2015 release, as part of which we have a new product called Knowledge Advanced. Before I go into the product, what I want to talk about is three key aspects of knowledge management. They are content, because that's where it starts. You want to be able to create content easily, as well as harness existing content. The next aspect is to make this content easily accessible to customers, to agents, and to deliver it in context. Make it findable and get feedback in the process. And the final piece is to go ahead and refine this on an ongoing basis by analyzing what's working and what's not and making administration changes to improve the experience on an ongoing basis. Today, we have customers who are service focused and we have customers who are more knowledge focused. And we have a product, existing product for each segment. We have the Oracle Service Cloud Knowledge Foundation product for our, ser for our service focused customers. And we have the Oracle Knowledge On-Premise product for customers who are looking for a standalone knowledge management offering. What we've done is we've taken key features from our on-premise product, integrated it with Service Cloud, and positioned it for customers who are looking for a highly capable knowledge management product, but in the cloud. And that's where Knowledge Advanced fits. So we have authoring with templates and versioning, making it easier to create content and track it. We have the ability to go ahead and harness existing content and crawl it and make it part of your experience in terms of making existing content more findable. We have natural language with industry dictionaries. And what the engine does is it understands everyday language across multiple languages, but also specific to particular industries. And we make this as part of the delivery experience we put it at the fingertips of customers and agents through web self-service or an agent desktop. And we have integrated analytics to measure the experience and make ongoing improvements. So let me walk you through knowledge creation first. With content authoring, with the, con the new content authoring module, authors can easily create you know, what you see, what you get, with your content, with rich media, making it very, very compelling and also run it through a rich publishing workflow to get the right approvals in place. There is access to versioning so that you can go back and see where a particular piece of content was, a particular knowledge asset was, and um, for compliance reasons, for example. Um, you can compare versions, you can go back to a previous version, and then harnessing existing content is as easy as taking a, a crawler, setting it up, and pointing it at it so that you can go ahead and um, harness existing internal documentation or repositories or websites and make that available as part of your larger knowledge base. So now we're going to talk about delivering knowledge. As part of delivering knowledge to your customers, what we are trying to do is put knowledge at customers' fingertips and make it easy to find answers. So here we have widgets for most popular answers and the most recent answers at customers' fingertips, powered by knowledge advanced and machine learning techniques. And if customers aren't finding what they're looking for out here, they can go ahead and search and ask a question. So in this case, as a customer, I'm looking for information, I'm searching. So I have a problem with my smartphone, so I say repair battery. And as I type that in, I can see results coming back across sources from deep within documents, whether they are authored in the knowledge base or PDFs. You can also see results coming back across languages, in English and Spanish in this case, and you see the engine understanding language. Even though the content says fix and the question says repair, the engine understanding has automatically linked that across language. You also see the ability to go ahead and filter down on particular areas of the content, if need be. And all of this 
is to make information more findable so that customers leave your site happy and having found their answer instead of unhappy and calling your contact center. Now let's talk about delivering knowledge to agents' fingertips and making them more effective. So part of delivering knowledge to agents is to put knowledge contextually at agents' fingertips so that you can improve contact center metrics and make it easy to reuse knowledge and make it easy for agents to find their favorites, which is what we've done here with this new knowledge tool window to let agents be more productive. And when an agent needs to drill in to find the answer to their question, they can double click and it'll pop up a more in-depth tool window so that they can drill into different answers by different criteria or they can change the search and um, look for a different answer. The next key aspect of knowledge management is refining knowledge so that you know what's working and what's not and you can make ongoing improvements. With Knowledge Advanced, we now have powerful knowledge reports and dashboards to help analysts understand gaps in knowledge, how knowledge is being used, authored, and being published, understanding whether knowledge is being effectively served via search, and understand if agents are reusing knowledge. We also have the capability to interactively improve the search experience by doing a step-by-step -step flow with integrated analytics to understand the search experience and make ongoing improvements and most importantly understand if those improvements are going to help or hurt so there's a visual feedback mechanism also to help analysts make the right choices. That's the overview of Knowledge Advanced. If you need more information you can visit our resources page where you'll find links to additional information about this and other Oracle products. Thank you for watching.